The age of fossil resources is coming to an end. We are on a journey towards a more sustainable future that is not reliant on fossil resources. A future powered by a range of innovative lower emission solutions that can help the world combat the climate crisis. We are a global leader in a wide range of renewable products, such as Neste My Renewable Diesel for the transport sector, Neste My Sustainable Aviation Fuel for aviation, and Neste Re for the polymers and chemicals sector, all produced from sustainable renewable raw materials. But what are they? We use a wide variety of sustainably produced and globally sourced raw materials at our refineries in Finland, the Netherlands and Singapore. For over a decade, we have focused on waste and residues as raw materials which, in 2021, represented over 90% of our global renewable raw material inputs. Today, these include used cooking oil, collected for example from restaurants, animal fat from food industry waste that is unsuitable for human consumption, vegetable oil processing waste and residues, such as spent bleaching earth oil, fatty acid distillates, and remaining oil derived from effluent sludge, fish fat from fish processing waste that cannot be used as food, tall oil-based raw materials, sustainably sourced vegetable oils, as well as technical corn oil, a residue from ethanol production. The raw material inputs in our refining may vary over time, from market to market and from product to product, based on the availability, price, as well as the market or customer-specific requirements and preferences. Our extensive raw material portfolio provides us with flexibility to meet these requirements, while enabling us to produce renewable products with consistent high quality. We continue to work towards increasing the availability of lower quality waste and residue raw materials while developing technologies to diversify our portfolio with completely new types of raw materials, such as agricultural and forest harvesting waste and residues, and suitable renewable materials for municipal solid waste streams. Further down the line, we aim to use other types of raw materials besides waste and residues. We are looking into developing novel vegetable oils from advanced agricultural concepts, leveraging the energy potential of CO2 absorbing algae, and even using CO2 itself as a raw material. There is no time to lose in combating the climate crisis. And, in order to succeed, we need to act, innovate, develop new, bolder solutions and deliver them faster than ever before. Together. Change runs on renewables.